What is going on guys and welcome back to another video. It's not political, we're back to football and I'm going to be doing transfer rumours uh, all through the summer, especially Chelsea ones as well as reviewing and previewing Chelsea Chelsea's pre-season campaign as well. It's been a busy uh, month or so really since the end of the season with transfers. Um, you know, updates on Lukaku, um, even Van Dijk, um, Bakayoko, I'm doing videos all on, on, on those in the future. But today we're going to be talking about Alex Sandro, somebody I dreamed that we might be able to get in this window, but never honestly thought it was going to be possible. By the way, player rate and predictions for FIFA 18 will be coming very, very soon as well. But let's just talk about today and the fact that Alex Sandro is moving closer to a move to the Champions Chelsea. Reported fee, about 70 million euros, about 60 million pounds. Now, don't get me wrong. That is overpriced, but in this market for the second best left back in the world, um, it's, it's probably about right. I mean, it is very expensive, don't get me wrong, but he is the second best left back in the world. Um, only Marcelo, really, you could argue, is better. And in the left wing back position, it is perfect for Alexandria. Now, we look like we made a bid um, earlier, a couple of weeks ago, for Sandro, which was rejected by Juventus. Um, I think it was a Juventus CEO who came out and said that basically the destiny of the player, you know, the destiny of a player is with in their hands type thing. That's not exactly what he fucking said. I can't say the quote properly because I've forgotten it, but it was something like that. Destiny, the future of the player is in their hands. We're not going to stand in the way. Um, and it looks like we're going to be going back in. I think it's still pretty much, I wouldn't say it's a certainty, but I think it is almost... Um, a certainty now some and it, it's not just a few sort of outlets that are reporting this multiple reports that the deal is close some even very reliable sources saying the deal is done um, and um, yeah no what a signing it will be for Chelsea left wing back position will be fantastic FIFA wise it's going to be great but in real life as well it's going to be fantastic and we welcome one of the best left backs in the world into the Premier League or so it looks like Betting-wise, it's odds-on that it happens now. So, betting-wise, it's expected to happen. As I say, fee probably going to be about £60 million. If you didn't know Alexandria, I think he's 26 years of age. But I think it's a very good signing um, for Chelsea and something that we need in our back four, or back five even. Um, and, you know, there's links with Van Dijk and Bonucci. Bonucci and, and Sandra, there's reports that there could be a £100 million double uh, raid of Juventus for both Sandro and Bonucci. Uh, Juventus are close to signing a replacement for Alexandro. Um, as well as that, we also see that they are linked with, and this is only linked with, but linked with a move for, uh, I believe, Marquinhos from PSG. Some saying that could be a Bonucci replacement. But the Bonucci uh, rumour is a rumour, but it won't go away, Bonucci to Chelsea. Alexandro has a little, more, a little bit more substance than the rest. Some saying the deal is done now uh, for Sandro. He rejected a contract and he will be allowed to move to Chelsea. Don't expect an announcement until July the 1st when Chelsea have uh, the night kit. I expect a few deals to be announced that day. I think Willy Caballero is a done deal. I think Sandro will be done by July the 1st. And I think probably Bakayoko. Uh, well, I think Bakayoko is done now. And I think that they'll all be announced on July the 1st in Chelsea's big kit announcement. Obviously, they are, were with Adidas. However, they are now with Nike. So, um, yeah, that's they're, they're trying to make that event as big as it can be. And I've been saying this on Twitter all summer. A lot of Chelsea fans are getting frustrated about the lack of business. But I was saying, look, the, we're not going to have any transfers really are going to be announced until we have that kit. We don't, we're not going to have fucking an Adidas kit type thing. You know what I mean? The, the new signs are not going to be there in the Adidas kit. It's not going to happen. So... I always expected this to happen. I got a bit of stick for it, but it, it looks like I've been proven right. Follow me on Twitter at Mr. VVKM. I retweet uh, rumours. I speak about rumours. I do different polls. So, yeah, you can interact with me on those to say at Mr. FIFA Cam on there. I've got a picture of, I think, Alexandra and a kind of Juventus stroke Chelsea kit, which I think may become very, very uh, realistic very very soon what a signing it will be for Chelsea about 60 million pounds and it looks like Alexandro is closing in on the move to the champions some saying an announcement on the agreement of a fee is imminent that's it for this video for this update if you enjoyed it please leave a like and I will see you
next time. Goodbye.